Rambo is a term that's been coined around the world for military aggression, or it's 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 been you know people have used it, you know whenever somebody wants to describe a, an aggressive person or somebody that's uh, you know uh, somebody that a killer or you know a military um, figure that's that you know that that doesn't take no prisoners. Um, but I think Rambo's. I think it's it's more of a tale of a of a of a man that's just uh, a normal man that got thrown through the mill that served his country and came out the other end a different person. He came out the other end a person that's been uh, troubled. Um, his mind has been you know confused. The, the fog of war. Who's he fighting for? What side he's on? I think a lot of times people think like that in real life. All the years of combat have kind of come to a head in his mind. Uh, I think he's, uh, uh, you know, he's, he struggles with post-traumatic stress disorder. He's, um, he's finally realizing the carnage and the atrocities that he's seen in the war, and you know, it's it's relevant in today's current climate with you know all the, you know, the satellite wars that we have on and soldiers coming home. I mean, you know, I don't think uh, post-traumatic stress disorder was really paid attention to, other than the last few years. And I think Rambo in this Rambo, I think Sly's addressed that. You know, with the script, he, you know, he addresses soldiers coming home from war. They don't just come home from war and forget everything. So in this last Rambo, I think we've, I think we've addressed the issues that are, you know, currently affecting soldiers now. Over the years, people have taken the journey with Rambo. You know, different generations, because it's been. I think the first Rambo came out in 1980. So it's, uh, audience, you know, you'll have an older audience, hopefully that will have seen the first one to a younger audience who will maybe watch the previous movies. But it's it's, it's like a journey that, that takes you through different stages and different um, times in Rambo's life. Different, you know, each movie he's hit some kind of political uh, hot point, be it Afghanistan, be it, um, you know, uh, 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 drug trafficking, you know, he's gone through a, um, you know, prisoner of war. So it, it, Rambo always has its foot in some kind of political issue or, or a relevant, you know, topical issue. And this one's no different. So hopefully, um, you know, people will give the Rambo fans what they want to see.